Hello and welcome back to the colony with Man and the Ants, playing some more Empires of the Undergrowth today, rather excitingly. So last time we started off the alpha demo levels and we did critters, so today we're going to do the nest. The only thing I am going to point out, it's not there at the moment, but I did see a thing on Slug Disco, who are the developer's Twitter page. If you remember back around Halloween, they had the Hungry Spider mode that I had a go at. Well, that mode does come back around full moon, so if I'm very lucky at some point... When I log into the game, I want to start up the game to do a recording, that spider's web will be back and we can have another go at Hungry Spider. I know they've done some more balancing on it as well, so clearly still working on the mode, so we can have another go at that at some point and see if I can do any better. Um, which shouldn't be too hard because I was fairly terrible last time, but then again it is supposed to be a very hard mode. So today, we're going to try out the nest then and see what this is about. So the last one, Critters, seemed to be about... An, a, a nest area with everything filled in, but had sort of predetermined sections hollowed out, which you broke into. This one, this one's interesting. So the only rule, where can we, can we go on? Yeah. How do you even get in there? Look, that seems to be entirely blocked off. That's interesting. And same up here, there are two areas that are completely blocked off. And we have to kill the Formica Fusca Queens. We have to kill other Ant Queens. That is relatively new. So let's come down here then and get this food first. See what sort of state this chamber is in. That's an awkward size a little bit, isn't it? We could use it. It's only one square out, I believe. Let's just bring up the... Uh, one of these. Yes, only one square. We could just put a speed tile there. Make it a proper chamber. Are you not going to get the rest of that food? I thought you'd get the rest of that food. How can I make you get the rest of that food? Why are you not getting the rest of that? Oh, I can just do that. Okay. Ha 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 ha. As always, the game is exceptionally loud. So let me turn down my headphones a bit. And I think there's a bit of food there. There's a bit of food there. Yeah, I think we're going to want to go straight for the nursery ants. Uh, not the nursery ants. The uh, the black ants. The melee ants. So, let's do that. You can carry on grabbing that food. We do, of course, need to make a food store as well. Maybe we make a food store under here and then we'll head down to there. I'm guessing, at a certain point, these might be Formica Fusca Queens, maybe, and they'll burst out. Almost certainly these ones at the ends will be. I'm assuming. A lot of assumptions going on, really, isn't there? So let's make a food store up here. And also break into there. Let's swap those over. We can send the ones up there to get some more food. And then we can actually probably turn this into the food store and use, use this as a second black ant nest, I think. I think that sounds sensible, doesn't it? Should get more than enough food in there. That won't be a problem. So let's do that now. You need to leave that tile free to make a speed tile. Does that food just automatically go in there? Because it's already technically there? I think it does, yes. Either that, I'll just have to move it a tiny little bit. Right, so that's giving us a nice boost on food. We can build a couple more of those. Lovely. Won't worry about the speed tile quite yet, but it's there if we need it. So, let's build another nest here. Yeah, let's do that. Quite dramatic amuse again. 
I think it's the same music from the last one, isn't it? But it is very dramatic. Um, a very dramatic take on the standard music. Lots of food up there. Look, that's nice. We can start building our second nest down here. We could probably also upgrade... Upgrade, even. Some of these food tiles, just so we can get more in there. That one a speed one and we might even be able to upgrade another yeah push push lovely add those to that group there so that other dude will go down there and start bringing back that food as well the music stopped weirdly Oh, there we go. It is coming back. I was wondering for a second. Can't upgrade any of those because it's a weird shape, but that's fine. We could always just hollow out a bit more space around it, couldn't we, to make it a bit bigger? That's fine. Got 400 space, though, for food or capacity, I suppose. Now, I am thinking at some point, once we've got maybe three nests going... We'll have to leave seven, I think, assigned to our queen and to the nursery section here, just because I don't trust these these ones at the side here, which have no apparent visible means of coming into the nest, suddenly breaking through and sending attackers right to our queen, which would be a bit, a bit of a pain. Don't really want that to happen. So we're basically out of food up there now. Just thinking where we can build. I was there's space up there, but I kind of wanted to do the food there, didn't I? So we could just build another one down here, perhaps. And I know we can do the bigger ones. So the the 19 tiles is it rather than the seven? If you just sort of expand around the hexagon, but I'm not too bothered at the moment. I think I think a number of small nest tables would probably suit us quite fine for this level. And then from there, if we continue on down, in fact, we could, oh no, could we? No, we couldn't. Oh, yeah, problems. Where are you, my uh, rampaging minions? Yeah, I should have had them with me from the start. That's my own fault. Right, there we go. That's those taken care of. The first enemies dealt with. So, the only place we can go now is in here. I well, suppose we can go there first. That looks like it might be a little bit more uh, palatable. Because this looks like it's going to be horrible. I'm assuming that's ants, but it's hard to tell. Maybe these are all ants, or maybe there's just these without any food on them. Maybe there's these two here at the very end. Maybe those are the ants. There's lots of food around, though, look. Oh, well, there's maybe one there as well. Yeah, I'm thinking that's probably the case. That these ones here without any food around them are the ones with the ant queens in. So sure we'll find out soon enough, though. Anyway. We're going to have to start thinking about more nursery ants as well at some point. We could always make those here. So they're quite close to the queen as well. But let's hollow that out ready. And we could probably fit another couple of nest sites in quite easily around that as well, couldn't we? Or do we want to have one there? I'm not sure that we do. Definitely get those two in though. I was going to see if I can move them down square, so if we could fit another one in there. But they start now. That's fine. Let them do what they want to do. So that will be our nursery ant. Is that what they call the nursery ants? Yeah, worker ant. They're all nursery tiles, that's what confuses me, but they're all worker ants. The worker ants and then the black ants. So, next best bet then is to come up here, isn't it? So, let's do that. Add those other seven to the attackers. 
Just because there's a few there. Not it's only three things. I'm imagining it'd be three small things, but you never know. And the fewer we lose, the more food we manage to retain to make more with. Yeah, it's only three piddly things. We should be okay, but we can never be too careful. And then this here is all blocked off as well. So I believe the only option we have, yes, is to go through here into this chamber here. So let's get ourselves as prepared as possible before we do that. Just looking where I could fit in another, um... Another black ant tie, uh, nursery. Maybe I'll make one of these a black ant nursery then. If we do that... Well, of course, there's also space up here, isn't there? And we could probably look at upgrading the ones we have as well, actually. But for now, I think we'll build another set of nurseries. Uh, worker ants. And then we will look at... Can we get all of them? We can. Okay. It doesn't leave us much spare food, but how much is up? There is a little bit. This should be enough to tide us over when we do get into an inevitable fight. We could build some speed... No, let's not build the speed tiles quite yet. Let's get... I'm a bit concerned about this fight, so let's get that fight out of the way first. Lots of work around us now, though. I like that. I like that. Right, so we've got a good deal of food. We've got a good deal of black ants ready to uh, kick some ass. So let's break through here. Yeah, they are a whole bunch of ants, look. And now, as it said, as I was concerned, we are going to get another attack very soon, look. We can just take care of these ones first. If everyone grabs as much food as they can, and then I'll move two of those groups back to the queen. So they are there ready for when this attack occurs. That seems sensible to me. And then from here, we can only come down here. I'm assuming maybe each time we annoy one group of ants, black ants, that will be attacked. That's what I'm thinking might happen. Are you seriously not going to walk over there and get the rest of that food? You lazy little buggers. Oh, the food stores are full. Okay, in that case, let's start getting some upgrades in. And... Ah, they just burrowed straight through from down there. Okay, I wasn't necessarily expecting that. And the near queen attacks soon, so I guess that means that these, these will be the ones on this side here. Uh, right, well, they're dealing with those. Let's get some speed tiles built where we need them. Right, so let's bring everyone back here, because I think we're going to need them soon. Then let's start upgrading. Did I miss one? I think I missed one. It's a little hard to tell. Are you doing something to that one? You are, okay. So we've got a good bit of food there. A little bit left over there. Of course, there are a whole bunch down there as well, aren't there? So what I might do is I might do that. Get those guys down there getting more food. In fact, was it worth sending? To, oh, I don't know. We'll have to see what this next attack is going to be like. Quite how that worked out. What, that, what that's got to do with the other black ants, I don't know. But I think it'll be fine if we send another two, another seven along with those. We have to add these to a separate and tell them to go up there. I assume they might go up there of their own accord, but that doesn't seem to be the case, does it? So where, where are the next ones going to break through then? Maybe this one here? 
Stores are full again, so let's go upgrade in another set. Did I do I can't. No, I didn't. Okay. And let's do that one. Now we're about to have... Another attack from the Black Ants. Let's send everyone there. How are we doing food-wise? We're doing okay. Got plenty in store. So once they've taken care of those, the ones are gonna go down there, the twos are gonna go down there. And then soon enough, there'll be a whole bunch more attacking. I'm cool. I reckon this one will be first. I reckon these guys will attack first. <laughs> Probably will need to build another. Black Ant uh, nursery at some point. It's going to expand this food food store a little. All right, everyone, come down here. They both came at once. I wasn't necessarily expecting that, I'll be honest. Honest. Queen attack coming in 60 seconds. That should give us enough time. I am going to have to look definitely at getting another... Another nursery set up there. We've also got... Oh, we'd use that one, didn't we? So we're going to have to start looking at using some of these other spaces. Oh, well, there's one there as well, isn't there? Oh, we're struggling a bit there. I think we are. I think we just didn't have a big enough group to take them on, so they kind of started picking us off a little bit, didn't they? And our food is almost gone. That's actually a massive problem. Oh, no, we've just about managed to get through. Let's stick those back over there. Uh, one's over there. You go back over there. Two's go down here. Oh, no, yeah, that's right. In fact, I should probably just turn like this into a food store or something, shouldn't I? That'd just be a bit quicker. Quicker all around. So let's just do that. Now, I'm not too bothered by whatever that is. Yeah, it's not too bad. It's only a few little, uh, little piddly things. If I make these three then... Send all the threes down there. They should take care of that without too much trouble. Stop taking it to the other food store. Just take it to this one. That's why I built it. It's the whole reason I built this food store. So it make it easier for you. But no, 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 no. The ones and twos come down here. I'm going to turn off your food gathering for a moment. Just so that we can actually try and get a bit of a group going. Didn't work perfectly, but it wasn't too bad. The threes, while they're fighting that out, I'm going to send the threes out on a foraging run down there. There are a lot of them. I'm going to add the threes to the foray over here, actually. Because there are a lot of them. They are overwhelming me a little bit. The problem is when they uh, can just swarm them. You need one big group on a big group, really. Whittling down a few of them a little bit, but it's not an ideal situation, I'll be honest. The next queen attack is only in 45 seconds. It's not giving us a huge amount of time to get through this. Maybe I need to think about getting some more worker ants and using those to go for the food. I think that's what I need to think about doing. 
Right, one's there. Two's there. Three's come back here. Will this be the last attack near the queen, though? I think it will be. Oh, there's a former Kafuska queen. We will murder her in a moment. Oh, yeah, I turned off all their food gathering, didn't I? Silly. Bit of food up there. Oh, did they come? Oh, it's a big one. It's a big one. I found some oh, loads of big ones, actually. Let's bring everyone back for this, I think, because that's a problem, and they're very near our queen. Why are they not using this food store? It's the reason I made that food store. Use it, people. All right, so that should hopefully be a bit bit easier to get take care of that now. How are they doing? One's nearly dead. There goes one. Yeah, they'll be fine now. There's loads of them down there bundling them up. So while they're doing that, I think I might make some more... I might just, in fact, stand it all the way up here if I've got enough food. Yeah. And this will be my food gathering clan. So they will be the fives. And the fives are not going to fight. They're just going to go after food. So now... In fact... We'll send the threes down here. And the one and twos. In fact, no, let's not do that. Because that's going to be see. The black ants will be here soon. Where are they going to come through? Here, I think. And probably just there. So if we gather everyone around, if we turn off their food gathering to actually keep everyone there, because they will start running off with food, which is lovely, don't get me wrong. It's lovely, but uh, you've got other things to do, mate. So the fives are down here grabbing some food. Look, it's just not using this food store here, though. Maybe I shouldn't have upgraded this one so much. I think they're trying to fill up the ones nearest the queen first, which kind of makes sense. Maybe I shouldn't have upgraded that one so much first. I don't think we'll have any more attacks near the Queen now. I think that's been sorted. Oh, it's not finished counting down, but there they are. A bit early. Does that mean we can get more in three seconds? We're getting a huge bundle. Ah, oh, there are more coming straight away, look. But, that's basically it. If we can take care of those, we are fine. And Oh, there are a few more trickling in from outside, look. But we are fine and dandy. There's a lot to take care of. We've got enough food to see us going, and the other oh, fives are finished there. The fives are still gathering food. As long as the... the Attacking ants don't push us back much further, which they're about to do. Okay, so now we've got a bit of a problem with the food for the uh, fives. Might get caught up in this battle a little bit. Yeah, they are, look. Okay, let's just leave the fives there for now, then. Otherwise, it's just going to cost us more. So we are whittling them down, but there's still a lot of them. And there are still more trickling in from outside every now and then. Look, a relatively steady amount. A lot of them on low health, though, so I think we're going to be okay. Yeah, look at all these ones we've got streaming in, look, to attack. Come on. I was going to say, boys, come on, girls, you can do it. We discussed this before, they're all girls. Yeah, they're basically done, aren't they? Fantastic. Right, so, what I want to do now is the twos are going to come up here. The fives are going to come down here. So we're basically out of food. The threes are going to come down here, and the ones are going to go and take on that queen there. So basically the twos are going to hold off these ones trickling in from outside. Whilst the fives and the threes get some food and the ones take out this queen here who's undefended. Right, 
Let's actually turn on their food gathering ability because they're all just stood down there at the moment. Oh, they're just going to work all the way straight up there, look. Okay. How are you doing? You taking out that one? Alright, well, as well come and take on this queen here then. Fair enough. See you later, Queenie. Oh, I say that. Oh, no, maybe not. Let's bring everyone up here then. One big push. In fact, what I could just do is just add everyone to group one. That'll probably do it, won't it? How are the fives doing? Basically done with that. Then we'll start sending them down there just in case we need more. Right, so we've got lots of ants here now. We should be able to bully our way up here. Let's turn off their markers. And yeah, take out that enemy queen look. There we go. Job done, lads. Job done. Well done. Boom. I quite like that. That's the first kind of ant on ant, ant attacking we've had. We've defended against them quite a lot, but I don't think we've actually ever taken out an enemy queen, have we? Don't recall that being the case. Yeah, so I thoroughly enjoyed that. Cool. Awesome. Good job, Slug Disco. Looking forward to seeing all these things implemented into the next big update, which they think is still on target for this year. Um, yeah, and that's going to be a huge update. Really looking forward to that with the leaf cutter ants and all sorts of exciting things. So, going to leave that there then. Hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, do click the like button. It really is appreciated. Subscribe to the channel if you've not already. Questions or comments, leave them down below. We'll get back to you as soon as I see them. Don't forget we stream Wednesdays at 6pm. Currently streaming Assassin's Creed Odyssey. A bit of a departure from Empires of the Undergrowth, but... If you want to come along and say hello and see what my ugly mug looks like, feel free to pop in. It'd be lovely to say hello to some of you. Otherwise, I'll see you next time in Empires of the Undergrowth. And as always, thank you very, very much for joining me.